It's not an easy trick. And he's carrying it off. And I should say the Democrats are helping him. They are. Take the focus on Russiagate. What's that all about? I mean, it was pretty obvious at the beginning that you're not going to find anything very serious about Russian interference in elections. I mean, for one thing, it's undetectable. I mean, the, in the 2016 election, uh, the Senate and the House went the same way as the executive. But nobody claims there was Russian interference there. In fact, you know, Russian interference in the election, if, if it existed, was very slight, uh, much less, say, than uh, uh, interference by, say, Israel. Uh, Israel, the prime minister, Netanyahu, uh, goes to Congress, uh, talks to a joint session of Congress without even informing the White House uh, to attack uh, uh, Obama's policies. I mean, that's dramatic interference with elections. Uh, not, not whatever the Russians tried, it's not going to be anything like that. And, and in fact, there's no interference in elections that begins to compare with campaign funding. Remember that campaign funding alone gives you a very high uh, pr a predict prediction of election electoral outcome. It's again Tom Ferguson's major work, uh, which has shown this very persuasively. That's massive interference in elections. Anything the Russians might have done is going to be, you know, peanuts and compared. Uh, as far as Trump collusion with the Russians, uh, that was never going to amount to anything more than minor corruption. You know, maybe building a Trump hotel in Red Square or something like that, but nothing of any significance. Uh, the Democrats invested everything in this issue. Well, it turned out there was nothing much there. They gave Trump a huge gift. In fact, they may have handed him the next election. Uh, that's just a, uh, that's a matter of being so in a, uh, you know, unwilling to deal with fundamental issues that they're looking for something on the side that'll somehow give political success. Um, the real issues are different things. Now, there are things like uh, uh, climate change, like uh, global warming, like the, like the, national, like the uh, nuclear posture review, uh, deregulation. These are real issues, but the Democrats aren't going after those. They're looking for something else. The Democratic establishment. I'm not talking about the young, the young cohort that's coming in, which is quite different. Well, that just all of that has to be shifted significantly if there's going to be a legitimate political opposition to the right-wing drift that's taking place. And it can happen, can definitely happen, but it's going to take work.